In good health, the FDA ban on artificial trans fat and foods is now officially in effect, but what does that mean for your favorite products and your health? Here's a closer look at the potential impact. The FDA rule banning trans fat in most foods in U.S. grocery stores and restaurants took effect Monday. It applies to manufactured trans fat, meaning the partially hydrogenated oils added to packaged and processed foods to give products a longer shelf life. The FDA estimates cutting trans fat from the U.S. food supply could prevent 20,000 heart attacks per year and 7,000 deaths. Consumption of trans fat actually increases your risk for things like heart disease, stroke, type 2 diabetes. It can increase your LDL cholesterol, which is your bad cholesterol, and it can decrease your good cholesterol, your HDL cholesterol. Many companies are turning to palm oil to replace the trans fat in their products, but trans fat won't disappear immediately. In May, the FDA granted some companies an additional year to reformulate their foods, and products currently on the shelves can still be sold. The ban will not apply to natural trans fat that comes from animals like cows, sheep, and goats. To check a product's trans fat, look at the nutrition label and the ingredients. So you also want to look at the ingredient list and, and look for the words partially hydrogenated vegetable oil, and that's also trans fat. Denmark actually banned trans fats 15 years ago, and studies have found a significant reduction in cardiovascular deaths there as a result. The World Health Organization recently called for the worldwide elimination of artificial trans fats by 2023.